What's up guys, it's Bucky, and in this tutorial we're going to be picking out an optical drive. Now if you're thinking, what's an optical drive? It is the CD or DVD drive in your computer. This thing where you put CDs or DVDs. So if you're thinking, alright, uh, what one do I pick out, a CD or a DVD drive? Uh, I got one answer for you, DVD drive. And this is really simple. A DVD drive can read and write DVDs and CDs. But a CD drive can only read and write CDs. So do you want CDs or CDs and DVDs? Pretty much buying a CD drive is pretty much like buying a piece of garbage. You can do it, but why would you? So always pick out a DVD drive, please. I'm begging you. The next thing I want to talk to you guys about is what kind of interface to pick out. Now, also, like we did in our hard drive, we had an option. A SATA, S-A-T-A, or an IDE interface. Now in our hard drive, remember I kept stressing you, buy the SATA. But in this tutorial, unexpectedly, I'm going to recommend go with the IDE because SATA for your optical drive just sucks because all the operating systems and all the computers stop recognizing SATA optical drives. So always go with the IDE interface when choosing an optical drive which is hopefully a DVD drive as I stated. So again right now we want a DVD drive and we want it to be IDE not SATA. Next once you picked out um, a DVD and IDE you're gonna come across a couple numbers when you're looking at drives. There, it's gonna be something like X16 or 24x20 x16 whenever you got a number standing alone with an x in front of it this is your read this is how fast that your computer can read that drive or get data off of it whenever you got three numbers like 24 times 20 times 16 these are respectively the write how fast you can put data onto the CD your rewrite how fast once that is already on there, you can put it on again and your read. Your last one is your read, how fast you can take information off of it. So again, once you got, if you got one number and you only got a DVD drive that you can read data, that's your read number. If you got three numbers, they're respectively always your write speed, your rewrite speed, and your read speed.